welcome to this Best Interest Assessor Refresher training course. My name is Sue Inka and I'm a trainer with Bonsolon and I'll be guiding you through six modules which will help satisfy the supervisory body for whom you work that you meet the requirements under the Mental Capacity Deprivation of Liberty regulations in order that you've had in the 12 months prior to your selection as a Best Interest Assessor completed further training um, relevant to your role as a Best Interest Assessor and also it will help you develop the necessary skills to continue to obtain and evaluate and analyse the complex um, evidence and differing views um, and weigh them in the decision making that you have to do as a Best Interest Assessor. The six modules will cover firstly the role of the BIA in the new era as we move into the Liberty Protection Safeguards as you transition. The second module will be looking at the definition of what is a deprivation of liberty and has that changed or will it change in the era of the Liberty Protection Safeguards. The third module is looking at the six Department of Health and Social Care fact sheets that were issued in August and that will be done over two modules. Um, the fifth module will look at the Form 3 and talk about does form and substance invalidate um, the authorisation. And the final module will touch on the interface between public law and best interests with some recent case law. Each module includes a video um, and activities uh, which will reinforce what you've learned and uh, will help you um, uh, consider how to apply this thinking in your work. I'll give you instructions um, for the exercises and tell you when to pause the video and you can use the course workbook uh, to write your answers and your reflections down and to keep for future reference. When you've watched the, all of the videos, you've completed all of the exercises and you've completed the evaluation form, which is really important for me at the end, you'll be able to then download your certificate of completion. I hope you enjoy the course and I hope it'll be valuable to you.